Welcome to Technical Drawing. Today we are going to draw this sum in orthographic. Front view we will see from here, top view and side view from here. See front view, top view and right hand side view. Now length is 90. See this. 90 plus 30. That is 120. Height is 50 plus 10. 60. And width is 60. So first we will draw layout and we will start with top view. Always remember it is advisable to start with a view which has circle. So in orthographic, we will start with circle. So I will mark 30 and I'll go inside by 30. I can draw center line. See total is 60. I will mark 30. Then from this point, you take this radius and draw a circle. So this is radius 30. Then you take radius 20. After that we have radius 15. That also will draw and radius 10 if you see the entire circle see this is diameter 20 so take radius 10 after drawing all the circles you just join those lines see this line and if you see this line this is 10 so from center you take 5-5 five, five and draw horizontal line. So we'll get that rib. It's called rib. And this is tangent. This is also a rib. Rib is a thin portion joining two member. Now top view is done. Rib we will study in section orthography in detail. So this is done. Now we'll go for front view. So when you see from the front, you'll see what? Rectangle. Always remember circle in one view, other two views will be rectangle. So this height is 25. So I'm marking 25. This will be also dark 60 and you join this part inclined portion. So we are almost done with front view also. Now what we have to do 10 let rip 10. So first we will draw this line. See from here we'll draw horizontal line till where wherever it will touch us in top view see it will be like a from top view we need to project because we don't know the exact place where it is ending so what we need to show we need to show a merging curve like this a small curve so it indicates that it is merging somewhere but we don't know exactly where because it's a tangent now we'll draw inside circle. I can write LRTB. Extreme left, right, top and bottom. There are four points. So in front view you will have two points. Extreme left and extreme right point. See this. So this will be dotted. And whenever depth is not mentioned it will be through and through. So that you should keep in mind. We can draw center line as well. Wherever you see circles, projection over there, you should draw center line. Now we'll draw this. L, R, T, B. L, R is not there. T and B. 
so again l will project up see this i'm writing lrtb only for your explanation in exam you should not write now when you see from the side what you will see again rectangle so that you can project from top view see this and it is advisable to use scale dimension as well because at times when you project from top view it may go one or two millimeter here and there so to manage that you project also as well as you take dimensions so your error will be less so now one two this rectangular strip three four so this is how you will get that smaller part inside view after that this part inclined portion that is from middle it is 5 five, five on both the sides right after that this rib so that you project from here front view now here also we don't know exactly where it is merging see it's very small this distance that we can project from top view see this so it will be here when you project and of course extreme boundary will be dark because of that circle so the boundary will be dark so if you see in the bigger circle also i'm using lrtb concept right extreme top and bottom point now we'll see this smaller circle tb so that will be dotted so that i can mark directly or you can project from top view so this is full dotted this, this will be also dotted after that this part see this part right so that we need to draw it over here now when you see from here in side view you can't see that part so that will be dotted so this is a t portion remember 90% of the time whenever two ribs they will meet they will form t section so this will be very useful concept in section orthography see this t portion this part is this part this part is this part now you can do labeling and dimensioning thank you